Utica police say they've nabbed this man right here suspected of robbing a bank over the weekend. They're crediting this picture too for helping catch and charge 45 year old Paul Carto. But as Nick Monticelli reports, there's a strange twist to this case in that it appears no part of this robbery was planned. So this was good police work to try to track down this bank robber. The public certainly helped, but what's really interesting in this story is how the robbery itself happened. It wasn't planned. It was almost a random crime of opportunity. It was this past Saturday along Van Dyke and Utica, a rainy, gloomy day when all of the sudden things changed inside of this Chase Bank. This man walked in, said he had a gun and demanded money. Notice he didn't do much to conceal his identity, and that's because it appears he had no plans to rob this bank. He was caught because of this security video. Someone thought he looked familiar and called the Utica Police Department. It's a good thing they did. A lot of times they're not sure. So when they come to us with the information, they're afraid of being wrong, okay? And in this case, it was very much the same set of circumstances, and they did come forward. And ultimately, things started panning out and moving in a good direction. That good direction led investigators to this man, 45-year-old Paul Cardo of Macomb Township. Once they figured out who he was and where he was, yesterday they went to his office, which is usually a better place to confront someone. So we have an opportunity to uh, take hold of the situation so that uh, we, we, we don't have a desperate set of circumstances on our hands. Speaking of desperation, it appears that's how this happened. Police say Cardo has confessed and told them he was on his way to work out on Saturday, saw the bank wasn't too busy, and made a detour to allegedly rob it. Just a matter of desperation, which is the point at which many people kind of get into these types of situations. Which explains the lack of concealment. Cardo was formally charged this afternoon with armed robbery. In Utica, Nick Monticelli, Local 4. Now, the money is still missing in this case. Detectives still working to track that down. They are freezing some accounts and are confident all of it can be recovered.